During the last debate, my opponent brought up some interesting ideas about the real world. Take a look. Let me tell you what, you want to get bad policy? Send a bunch of people who have never worked in the real world. For you to be able to pass good policy, you need real world experiences. Is where you have had to take those issues, break them apart, and deal with them in the real world. I don't care what you read at Harvard, it is different than real world dealing with real situations. I'm glad my opponent brought up the real world. Well, let's have a talk about that. The real world is a dangerous place. It's fraught with peril, both foreign and domestic. The real world is a place where bad people want to do bad things to our values and our country. The real world is about patrolling dangerous places in the darkest hours of the night, blinking away the sleep from your eyes, and wondering if that next turn in a blackened valley will put you in rifle range of the enemy. The real world is putting eight of your friends in the ground, good men who made the ultimate sacrifice for our flag, our faith, and our freedom, watching those stars and stripes folded in a tight triangle and handed on behalf of a grateful nation to a grieving wife, parents, or children. The real world is a 5 a.m. phone call from halfway around the world. It's an army doctor telling your wife that you may not come home alive, and if you do, it won't be intact. The real world is hard, it's unforgiving. It's a place of sacrifice, it's a place where freedom is under attack, where Christian values come under assault every day, and where we need warriors to pick up a sword and fight for the things that matter. Family, faith, flag, friends, and freedom. In the real world, Americans live paycheck to paycheck to give their kids a better life. We get barbecue, we attend world famous rodeo, and we take cheesy pictures in fields of blue bonnets. I think my opponent's right. You need someone with real world experience. And I'm ready to bring the same fighting spirit to Congress that I took to the mountains of Afghanistan and the deserts of Iraq. This election is about protecting the real world, your world, our world. So sign up, volunteer, join us. I invite each of you to be my teammates as we fight to bring change to Washington. Thank you.